What's up, you guys? It's your girl Sadie, and I am back with another video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and make sure you click that bell so that you can receive post notifications of the next time that I decide to drop another video, you guys. If you don't know, I'm on a road to 2,000, well, not 2,000, but 3,000 subscribers. So I hope that you decide to subscribe to my channel and stay updated with more CU Bus news, you guys. Um, as y'all know, that transfer portal is still open and it does not close until April the 30th um, for undergraduates and May the 1st for graduate students. Um, and people are entering it and <laughs> people are coming in, coming out, you know? And so we knew, well, I knew that today that we would have somebody that was gonna enter the portal because they've been trying to talk about it um, via Twitter. If y'all are on Twitter, y'all stay updated on CU Bus News. So, um, per Pete Nakos, Colorado running back, Savion Wilkerson has entered the transfer portal as a grad transfer. He followed Coach Prime from Jackson State and he rushed 1,167 yards and nine touchdowns in 2022, you guys. Um, Savion Wilkerson is an awesome, awesome running back, y'all. I enjoyed watching him play at Jackson State because he was really dominant out there and did his thing with Coach Prime on the Jackson State team. And when he came to Colorado, I was really excited because I was hoping he would have came, you know, in the very beginning to Colorado, you know, um, when Coach Prime first went over there, but he didn't. And when he decided to come, oh, that made me really excited that we got Savion Wilkinson on the squad, y'all. And he's a big, strong running back. Um, right now, I think he was out on injury. And I do know we have more running backs coming in. So I figured, you know, that's why he was wanting to leave. And, you know, we can't do nothing but wish Savion Wilkinson the best, y'all. So stay tuned for more CU Buffs updates.